or become aware of the calling that exists in the hearts of billions of people right now all across the world. And this is the calling for clarity. It's the calling for resolve. It's the calling for harmony, for peace, for love, for forgiveness. It's been in the hearts of mankind for a long time. We are in a position to answer that calling. So it's really an honor to step up every day in your life and ask yourself, where are my actions coming from and what are they contributing to? What's the intention behind my every action, behind my every spoken word, behind even my every thought? Meditation has profoundly impacted my life positively, quieting the mind and coming more from the heart coming from unity, coming from oneness, coming from love. It has freed me from most of my anxieties and fears that I've had up until then. And it has allowed me to really see through and beyond the thoughts. Uh, my most profound experience has been the realization that I am beyond thoughts because I can see thoughts, so I am not them. And the ability to say that I am not going to identify with thoughts anymore. The most profound thing I've experienced during meditation was non-separation. I've seen that we think there's a me and a not me and an inside and an outside. But all of that is just comes from labeling of the mind. In fact, it's just one continuous wave. For me, meditation is, I use it as a tool when I'm feeling overwhelmed, when the world is just too much, um, or my energy is feeling low, and I just need a reset, you know? I just need to reconnect with that inner peace and just be for a moment. It's so, so powerful, honestly. Both meditation, as well as Bhantiyu Masaru, have changed my life. Um, I don't know where I would have been without it. I now can see in my own direct experience that I am the awareness in which the whole world and even the whole universe appears. Peace, love, joy, freedom, even in the midst of emotional turbulences or just in the midst of life itself. Nothing can be compared to this directness of experience. Feeling the one love, the one peace that is always present, always here and now. The more that we clean out our personal stuff, the more that we empty ourselves of this imagined sense of separate me that somehow is over here, the more we empty that, the more naturally this calling can come forth through us and it can reinform our actions, our thoughts, our desires, our motivations. I encourage you to give this gift to yourself. <laughs>